Direct News TV July 26, 2023 Israeli troops kill Palestinian man during West Bank raid Israeli troops have killed a Palestinian man during a raid in the occupied West Bank, the latest bloodshed in one of the most violent stretches of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict in years, according to the Palestinian Health Ministry. The official Palestinian news agency Wafa said a man was killed in the Allied refugee camp near the West Bank city of Nablus during clashes with troops that surrounded a house in the camp. A young man died of his wounds as the occupation forces stormed the city of Nablus at noon, 9 o'clock Greenwich Mean Time, the ministry said. The martyr, Muhammad Abd al-Hakim Nada, was shot in the chest. The Israeli army said it had entered the camp and arrested a suspected militant. Wafa said another man was killed during clashes with troops that surrounded a house in the refugee camp. A Palestinian fighting group, the Al-Aqsa Martyrs Brigades, said its fighters had ambushed a unit of special forces in the alleys of al Ain camp and managed to inflict casualties among the Israeli troops. In a statement on its Telegram channel, the group, which is linked to Palestinian President Mahmoud Abbas's FATA movement, did not specify whether the dead man was one of its fighters. The Palestinian group Hamas, which controls the blockaded Gaza Strip, condemned what it said was a Zionist crime in Nablus. Wednesday's incident came a day after Israeli troops killed three Palestinian gunmen who opened fire on soldiers near Nablus. Hamas said the three were members of its armed wing. Violence has surged in the occupied West Bank since last year, when Israel began conducting near-daily raids, leading to hundreds of arrests and killings. In recent months, the West Bank has also witnessed a mix of the rise of local armed Palestinian groups carrying out shooting attacks against Israeli soldiers and settlers. Earlier this month, Israel's most forceful raid into the West Bank in nearly two decades killed 12 Palestinians and one Israeli soldier. So far this year, more than 161 Palestinians have been killed in the West Bank, the highest death toll in more than a decade. My name is Kingsley. Please like, share, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can be the first to be notified whenever we post you won't regret it.